Hey guys, Thunder E here, and welcome to the only gaming video on the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra that you care to watch. I'm talking about right here on Board at Work. This is the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra, and this device is so cool. The bronze color is really nice. The camera hump is quite massive, especially when you compare it to the S10 Plus from last year. Side by side, they're almost similar in height. The Note 20 Ultra is a little bit bigger. Uh, taller I mean, but the, that camera hump also houses a 108 megapixel camera. Now, in terms of performance and processing, we've got the Snapdragon 865 Plus processor, 12 gigs of RAM, 4,500 milliamp battery, um, and of course, you know, that should give us some really good gaming performance. But when we talk about gaming, we also talk about the display, because that's really important now. We've got a 120 hertz display with a 240 hertz touch sensing, uh, capability, which means it should feel butter smooth. Yes, but to just to let you guys know, it's an adaptive uh, display, which means it it automatically detects what you're doing. So while you're gaming, it will vary between 48 and 120, depending on your game. So game developers, please try and match up to high refresh rates for screen. So we'll be checking out some games, COD, PUBG Mobile, some Fortnite, Mix and match ways. We'll also be doing some gaming on decks as well, so you guys will get to see that. And uh, we also might check out some um, uh, Xbox Game Pass. So, not wasting any more time, let's check out some of that gameplay. Fight. Yeah. Oh. 
So gaming looked pretty good. Things ran rel re relatively smooth. And I'm sorry, I can't give you temperatures, I can't give you benchmarks, and I can't give you FPSs because we are waiting for an update. So that will come in my review. I'll give you all that breakdown there. But overall, gameplay experience looks smooth and we ran everything at max spec. So take it as you will, right? Um, now, when it came to audio, things sounded really good as well. Uh, audio was clean, crisp, and clear, but I'll give you a quick audio sample for you guys to listen as well. So audio seems good, uh, gaming is pretty fluid, uh, but when it came to gaming with DeX Wireless, I was truly impressed with that whole functionality. Not just with DeX Wireless, but the fact that this device is pretty much like a portable Xbox, right? Uh, the fact that you now can get Xbox Game Pass uh, with it, and please, if you're pre-ordering your device, make sure you get the controller bundle, you, you know, it, it's free. Get that with it so you can actually game, or, like what I did, I used the Razer Kishi. There's an Xbox Razer Kishi uh, controller, or at least specific, even though it's quite similar to the regular Razer Kishi. Uh, just the buttons are changed in terms of the notations. Uh, but I was able to use that to play Xbox Game Pass games directly on the device. That was cool to see, playing, uh, you know, uh, Tekken 7, uh, playing some Forza. That was great. That was good to see, and also being able to cast that wirelessly with wireless decks to a TV and still game. So I can travel, I can go anywhere, I can, say for instance, I go back to like, you know, you go back to your parents' place, there's nothing for you to do in terms of entertainment. You want a game, but you might want to extend it to a big screen TV, or you might want to actually use it for two different things, aka cast wirelessly, so you can actually have YouTube playing or you know a streaming show, and then you can game on your smartphone, uh, and you can connect to Xbox Game Pass. I cannot wait to try that out. And I'm happy to see Microsoft and Samsung coming together and awesome integration. I think for gamers, these are the kind of things that we love to see. So I know you guys want to see more and I know uh, there's more I can definitely tell you, but I can't tell you more yet. Stay tuned for the full review. If there's anything specific you want to see uh, me cover on the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra, let me know. Leave those comments down below, ask your questions. I definitely answer them as I always do. Uh, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. If you want to pick up your Note 20 Ultra, a link is going to be down there for you. you want to pick up the Razer Kishi as well, I'll have a link for you. Uh, works well with Xbox Game Pass and works well also with a lot of Android games. So that's something to take note. Anyway, guys, thank you very much. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and always enjoy your entertainment.